For this episode of the Ducati World Premiere, we came to the home of our Lamborghini friends. We are inside the Muditech, the Museum of Technologies. Ducati and Lamborghini share a territory called the Motor Valley, a unique place in the world. The manufacturers of the most sporty and desirable cars and motorcycles in the world are located within a 100-kilometer radius around Bologna and Modena a place devoting great attention to training. Here, there is a program called MUNA, where tomorrow's engineers working in this field are educated. A place with a great passion for food, for feeling good, but at the same time, with a great dedication to work. The ability, too, to overcome difficulties as they arise. And it is here, in the heart of the Motor Valley, that this unique project was born. It will be the subject of this episode of the world premiere, the extraordinary Diavel 1260 Lamborghini. A project like this could have been born only in the Motor Valley, only between two such like-minded brands, and only by working with friends like those at the Lamborghini Style Center. Our factories are only 20 kilometers away. We share many passions and work together in many areas, but we've never done this before on a production motorcycle. Ladies and gentlemen, the Diavel Lamborghini. When we started thinking about the bike, Claudio Domenicali remembered the Cian FKP37, dedicated to Professor Pich, which he saw at the Frankfurt show in 2019, and which he immediately fell in love with. And we found the perfect link between Ducati and Lamborghini for a four-handed project. It's a dream for everyone who does this job. By creating a Diavel inspired by Cian, we celebrated the values we share with Lamborghini. We are Italian, we are sporty, and design is a distinctive element of our creations. There's always been a great connection with Mitya Borket, the director of the Lamborghini Style Center, who is a motorcyclist, a Ducatista. So we started working on the idea and the project took shape. But I'd like to hear it from him. Welcome to the Lamborghini Style Center. For me, it is important to welcome all Ducatistas, because I too am a Ducatista. At Lamborghini, we are famous for having design in our DNA. It all started with the Countach. Two things are important to me, not only the silhouette, but also the architecture of the car. We have a very particular window angle that is distinctive from Lamborghini. Almost a year ago, we presented our masterpiece in Frankfurt, the Lamborghini Cian FKP37. We are very proud of it. We presented it, for sure, also in a very special color, a matte green called Verde Gea. Also in the Cyan, we have inserted all the contents of the Countach, and we've realized a Lamborghini of the future. We have created this Y theme, which is important and meaningful for Lamborghini, and for which we are famous. Equally important are the rims. 
which are beautiful and very technical and give the car a very special style. I am a Ducatista. I like super sport bikes and the mudguard concept follows this inspiration. I made them so that they seem almost detached from the volume of the car. Especially the rear mudguard, which is like the fairing of a motorcycle. We are also famous for the hexagon, in that we put three hexagonal lights, as in the Kuntach. Do you remember about a year ago? I came here with a Diavel here in this room. I parked the bike next to the car and we started thinking. You were very good. You explained the basic concepts of Cyan and therefore this design obviously inspired by the DNA of the front nose. The concept of the streamlined beauty, the external and internal flows of the car. This design made not only by taking care of the main body, but also by adding external volumes. Kind of like the fairings on a motorcycle, don't you think? Yes, a very nice element are the rims. The transition from the rim of a car to that of a motorcycle, I still can't imagine how you could do it. The rims on your car are a work of art. So we try to stay true to the rim to the point of using the same color. Do you remember? Yeah, good combination. I asked you what color we were going to use. It's a beautiful match. Andrea, all I've seen so far are pictures. Shall we see the bike? I'd say it's the right time. We've got the bike. Let's go see it. Spectacular. I love this piece. Wonderful. Beautiful, gorgeous. We have to take a ride. We have to take a ride. But Andrea, but I'll take the bike. Okay, I'll take the car. The Diavel Lamborghini is a Diavel. Great stage presence, unique and distinctive. It's powerful and muscular, but also agile between the curves for great riding enjoyment. Its ergonomics are comfortable and sporty at the same time. Its design perfectly integrates the DVT1262 Testa engine. An engine that in Euro 5 configuration delivers 162 horsepower and offers a torque of over 13 kilograms at 7,500 RPM. The standard Diavel is also equipped with the Ducati Quick Shift Up and Down. The chassis is sporty and top level. Single-sided swinging arm, Olins at the front and rear, fully adjustable. Brembo braking system with M50 radial mount calipers. The Diavel Lamborghini has a dry weight of 220 kilograms. As we said before, the bike has been designed applying the same stylistic language that distinguishes the car. This is as much about the whole as it is about the details. In fact, to make this new creature, we have redesigned all the components that characterize the design of a Diavel. The air inlets, the radiator cover, the front and rear mud guards, clearly the exhausts, the seat cover, but especially the rims. The rims are an essential component for a bike like this. They are forged, beautiful, lightweight, and make the bike immediately unique. A 240-45 sports profile tire is mounted at the back, while the front mounts a 120-70 tire. And since the inspiration is the Cyan FKP37, the whole fairing was obviously made of carbon, a beautiful, precious and light material. Two of the hallmarks of Lamborghini design are the Y-shaped stylistic element and the hexagon. 
the seat with suede upholstery, a nameplate that echoes the color of the frames and rims, has Y-shaped stitches, while the hexagon is found on the exhausts made of carbon. The paints are exactly the same as the car, the matte green of Green Jaya and the gold of Oro Electrum. We have balanced the colors to ensure harmony of the shapes, but at the same time give strength to important elements such as the frame and the rims. You've seen the number 63 on the side of the bike. Why this number? It's a magic number for Lamborghini. It's the year of its foundation. It is therefore a clear homage to the car that inspired the Cyan FKP37, a car manufactured in only 63 units. The bike is numbered and limited to 630 units, 10 times the number 63. The bike number can be found on the aluminium plate attached to the frame. When sitting on the Diavel Lamborghini, you will appreciate many more details even before you start riding it. The Diavo Lamborghini, like the whole family, is equipped with a double instrument panel, a module with warning lights and a 3.5-inch color TFT screen. At Kion, the Lamborghini and Ducati badges are shown on the instrument panel and the bike silhouette appears. These are unique details that underline the value of this bike. The instrument panel, of course, gives access to all the information of the bike and allows you to configure the latest generation electronic systems that it is equipped with. The handlebar controls are backlit and the bike is hands-free like all Diavils. And still on the subject of attention to detail, we have created a dedicated helmet. It's a jet model, top of the range, inspired by the livery of the bike, available exclusively for the owners of the motorcycle. The Diavel Lamborghini enriches the Diavel range, which includes Diavel 1260 in dark stealth color, from Diavel 1260S in two colors, Ducati red and black, and indeed the Diavel Lamborghini. Two jewels of style, but also a concentrate of technology and performance. It is beautiful to admire them as much as it is beautiful to enjoy them on the road.